guys, and welcome back to another episode of my No Meat Run of our Yes, that's right. Today, we're back with another episode, and Monkey Doug is very excited, because today is all about Easter, that is right. The day this is coming out, it's Easter, and we're going to get some Easter games. Not really, but you'll see what I mean. Um, today, our goal is to get a new trike and a new stego. If you remember... If you remember, Mike the Trike died last episode to some terror birds, and so did our Stego. So, I mean, rip them, but we gotta get new ones. Or else the Herbivore army will not be complete. If you haven't watched the other videos, go ahead and watch them. They should all be on the channel. Um, this is either episode 13 or 12, I'm pretty sure 13. But, it is not an unlucky day because we still have the rest of the gang here. Nobody else has died. Since we were gone, and we should probably move Cluck inside. So, we'll do that soon. But, yeah, that's the goal for today. If you remember last episode, we set up this little contraption over here. In this pen, with a bunch of Easter bunny dodos and one bunny over after. I'll show you how it's been doing. It's actually very efficient. I'll show you how many eggs I have, but today, we're going to make some new Easter cosmetics. Look at all those eggs. Look at all those candies. We're gonna be using them. We got a master craft candy right there. I think that's all of them. Come back here, monkey dog. But yeah, this is probably the most um, this is probably the most efficient way to get these types of things. To get bunny eggs. But yeah, if you want Easter eggs, set up a little pen. Just drop a bunch of dodos in there. And boom, you're gonna have as much as I have. We have 338 of them. And I'll go ahead and show you my candy stash. These are all the candies. I'm only saving Mastercraft and Ascendant. I'm not saving any other ones. So, yeah. We're gonna use these dino candies on a couple teams today. So I'm gonna grab a couple of them. We're gonna go see who we can change the colors up. Now, we need, really need to kill this Bronto. So I'm sorry for that. Um, we'll kill him soon, but like I'm saying before we start We're gonna uh, use one on tank and see how we oh wow. Oh wow. Wow. That is really cool tank Well now tank looks amazing. She is Man that is beautiful colors uh, What can I say that's very beautiful and the last person I want to use it one on was Harambe We gave one to monkey Doug last episode. So today They'll give you one, and oh my, they're like cousins, Monkey Doug and Harambe. They're both red and white. Coincidence, or was it destiny? We'll never know. But with that out of the way, let's go again to the episode. I'll explain what we're going to do, and all we got to do really is make some traps. Really? We don't need a trap for a trike now with this new crossbow. But we probably should make a trap for a stego, so we're going to go ahead and do that. It's going to be out of wood, of course, so let's grab some fiber. And let's get to chopping up some wood. We can make the trap, and I don't know what happened. Okay, there. Let's get into it. Bang, 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 bang. There we go, bunch of thatch. And just like that, some wood. Now basically, if you haven't seen any of my traps, they're just a 4x4, four four, not 4x4, four 2x2 four, two two of wood, and it's too high with door frames as the walls. So you can shoot at creatures while they can't shoot at you. I'm gonna finish this real quick. We just need a bunch of door frames, probably out of wood again. But in total for this trap, if you want to make it yourself, you need 16 door frames. Um, you need 16 door frames, 4 foundations, and 4 ramps. And that's for any material you would like. It's pretty effective. Um, so yeah, go ahead and try that out in your own survival world. And hopefully then you can use it on creatures that actually eat meat and are pretty strong. I'm not saying herbivores are bad, because they're amazing. But, yeah, I'm kind of stuck with only them for the whole playthrough, so... That's been pretty fun, I do have to say. It's a challenge I did not expect to be as hard as it is. The main problem we're gonna have to come up with is a way to get underwater without drowning. I think we're gonna use turtles, but 
can't be certain. So, I we have the trap now. So now all we gotta do is really just find what we're gonna tame, and yeah, that's it. So I'm gonna go, go run over to Iris, and we'll take off. I'll just drop these for now so we can get this out of the way. But I will meet you guys when we find something to tame. Okay guys, we're back, and I found a level 75 trike. I mean, that was around the same level that Mike was, so I think it's a perfect tame. We're gonna just find somewhere to stand after we get the six porno and just drink them out. So let's see here. Let's get the six porno. Perfect. I'm not sure what that's about, but something new. We also have a stego here. We have multiple stegos here, even a tech stego. So let's see which one's the highest level. We can go ahead and tame that one too, actually. That one's level 10, and the tech one is level 12. So they are out of the question. Well, looks like the 25 we'll be taming today. First, though, we should probably kill this Therizino and these raptors before they kill the team we're trying to get. Man, those things do a lot of damage. If you are unaware, this thing is doing 60 damage, and it's only level 35, which is pretty insane. So we're going to be using them in the boss fights to hopefully take down the Gamma Overseer. I think we can do it. Nobody's here to stop us, so we can just go ahead and speed through the bosses, and we'll be all good. Finally, we just got to go take out those raptors that were down here. I don't know where they are now. And I know this Stego died, so something must have killed him. I'm pretty sure it was the Raptors. I'm not sure. Ah, uh, there they are. Okay. So we're going to kill these guys really quick. And then after that, we will go ahead and build the trap. We can actually use the trap for both of these teams since they're so close together. After we kill these Trodons. And they're tanky. That's why they're dangerous. Finally, Raptor. Um, why are you out? Okay, there we go. First off, I say we start with the Stego, actually, since it's all alone. And these trites are in pairs. So, we're going to build the trap. Really easy, as you can imagine. Just put it down in a square like this. There, probably should get off. Then door frames should also be easy. Just put them down like that. And there. Just make sure they're too high. I mean, if it's a creature that can't jump and isn't that big, then you can always just use this trap, but it's one high. I've done it with a dodic before. If you didn't watch that video, go watch it right now. Okay, and I just got add in the ramps, but it looks like Iris is in the way. I'll just back her up. And that should fit right there. Okay, that is not fitting right there. Great. I'm not sure why that is, but whatever. Now, finally, we just move Iris down here. And we just go shoot the Stego once, store it into the trap. Then we can easily knock it out. But speaking of Stego, where is that Stego? It was just over here a second ago, and now it's gone. Did it go down here? That's a Pterodon. We got a Packy. Packy wouldn't be a bad team. We will get them eventually. We got Trike. The Trike, one of these we're gonna be taming today to be the Easter Mike. I'll just name it Easter Mike instead of Mike the Second. Okay, let's run up here. Maybe he's up here. Oh, I got a little stuck there. No Stego. There's absolutely no Stego over here. There's a tech raptor though, so I'm just gonna run back this way. And that's a regular raptor. Luckily, I think we're faster, so we're just gonna sprint down here. 
Okay, um, there he is. That took longer than I would have liked. But we're just gonna shoot him once. Oh gosh. Oh no. Let's just bowl one. No, let's just kill it with the sword. We got it. Okay, now the stego's falling. I didn't mean to hit it there, to be honest. Um, is it still falling? Come on. I'm trying not to knock it out right here, because if I knock it out here, it's in danger. Because it doesn't have anything protecting it. That's why traps are nice. They kind of protect the creature, too. Okay, it's still falling. Just make sure we line it up. Perfect. Come on, man. Perfect, and it's in. Now we just immediately have to start drinking it. Before this thing breaks the trap. Shouldn't be too hard. Traps have thousands of health, I'm pretty sure. Okay, it's almost out. It's only level 25. It shouldn't even take this long. Wow, how is it hitting me? I don't understand. Come on, go out. Go out. There, it's running. That's Torpor running. That means it's Torpor's high. And. It is out. Perfect. So, you know what? I'm gonna put some berries in it and I will bring you guys back when it's done tamer. And boom, it is now tamed. There you go. That's a stego. And it is out. So we're just gonna cryopod him up. We'll make him saddle when we get back to base. Now for the trike. Let's see how we can get this one done. Also, when we get back to base, I want to make cells for a couple other creatures like the Fiomias, the Parasaur we have, and also the Megalosaurus plus Tank if we can afford it. So let's go find those trikes and get them into the trap so we can get Easter Mike. Yeah, we're going to use an Ascendant Candy. See what cool colors he gets. And mm hmm. I'll be it for the episode. Um, let's run up here. Maybe get a view down. See if that helps. I don't think they could have gone far, so we're just gonna run straight this way, I guess. See what we can find. And is that it right there? That's something. No, that's a pair, sir. Not what I'm looking for. Aw, oh, man. The morning music in Ark, so peaceful, so happy. It always feels good to survive another day. Speaking of day, what day is it? It's day 37. I wonder what day it will be when we beat the Overseer and put this series to rest. Only time can tell. Are those them down there? Oh, no, but we have a 95 and 85. To be honest, I don't mind that. So, you know, we're just going to go with them. See if we can get one in the trap. And if not, oh well. So let's run over here really quick. Are you, what level are you? We'll just go with this 85 right here. First of all, we're going to need some berries. Not only for teaming, but also for me to eat. Because, as you can see, I'm thirsty. And I'm not going to gain much stamina if I'm thirsty. So, let's get our crossbow out. And get ready to run. And that was a gal minus. Great. Okay, we shot it. We're gonna just run this way now. Is it falling? Oh, it's falling. Charge, charge. It's not charging. Oh, great. We ran into a tree. Oh no. I'm just gonna keep running. It hasn't lost aggro yet, so we just gotta keep running. Okay, are they still falling? Yep, he's still mad. Here he comes. Yep, you're the 85. She is very mad. Okay. Okay, we might actually, is that one a male down there? Cause, I mean, the gender doesn't matter. You don't have to be a boy to be named Mike, but I am 
It'd be nice to have a boy. That's all I'm gonna say. Okay, they're coming. Just straight ahead is the trap. This is really risky. I wouldn't suggest doing this for larger creatures. If you find a large creature that's fast enough and you're not faster than it, I would just suggest building the trap by the creature so it's much easier to get in. Okay, there we go, we got the sliver. Okay, perfect. He lost that. She lost aggro. Now we can kill this soldier and that dillo. Now one more shot should get her in the trap. What? How did that miss? There we go. This should do it. Okay, she's turning. Perfect. The angle is perfect. And. Uh, Okay. So we're gonna be like that, right? Oh no 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 no. Get, get me out. Oh that was very risky, but we did it. Oh my Um that is not okay. That was not supposed to happen. How did he do that much damage? Um okay. What? He's only doing sixty seven. What? Comment down below, please comment down below if you know what just happened. I am very scary. Um, what powers does this strike possess that it literally can just do that? We might want to go for a lower level then, because this thing is very dangerous. And it's not like we need a strike for actual gameplay, we just need one. Because, I mean, we teamed Mike, so we can't just give up on him like that. I'm so confused. What was that? I'm just lucky that I'm fast enough to get out of there. It broke my armor and everything. She is evil. Pure evil. That was horrible. Okay, we're gonna find another trike and I'll meet you guys when we find something. Oh, wait. Will I? If these are a good level, I might not have to. Let's see. You are a level 25. Perfect. They had a male. And I want the male, preferably. And that one's only a level 10. So we might just kill him. But 25 is a good level. So. I will not see you when we find a trick. Because I have found a trick. Now, to just fly over here, I guess. Just take you down here, buddy. Oh, we got another one? Oh, okay. Three of them? Where are they coming from? What? What? They're coming out of nowhere. It's not even fair. Okay, we're just gonna try and kill them, I guess. That was the 25. What level are you? 110. Aw, oh, man. And another one? Oh, I'm gonna die here, guys. I need water, I'm losing health. What up are you? 85, aww. This is not going good. Who knew taming a Triceratops could end so badly? Not me, I did not know that. We're gonna fly over here, I guess. This might be a 20 minute episode after all, because of how long it's taking to find, how long it's taking to find a trike that can actually be tamed. So why don't we just head to the old base? It's right here. Maybe there will be a trike there as a little gift. Uh, hope you hope you're doing well, gift. We got the Bond on Army and a bunch of Wyvern names. Okay, I don't know how those haven't lost all their health. That's kind of weird. But no trikes. Hmm. Now that I think about it, no creatures really at all. I see a couple of dillos there, but. Nothing on the beaches. Okay, we found a pterodon, tapajara. Here we go, trikes. I was about to say, they're not that hard to find. A 10. Perfect. And a 10. A 10 and a 10. So we're just gonna kill you really quick. Okay, we accidentally killed some bunny dodos. 
no, 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 no. Please do not die to a raptor. This guy for you. Don't worry, Mr. Trigger. You are in good hands. Okay, okay. You stop it. Raptor, stop. Why are you mad at me now? I didn't even hit you. I didn't even hit you. Why are you mad? How are you mad? What? Oh, I didn't know that can hit me. Oh, no. We gotta be careful with this. I don't know how we're gonna do it. And now you're charging? Oh. Well, why are trikes so mean to me? Mike was never like this. Mike was so nice. Then we just get a bunch of ugly little annoying trike people. They're all girls. But Mike was the true hero. He was never mean to me. Oh, didn't mean to hit you. I'm sorry. All right, so we're just gonna play the flying game, I guess. Where we just... Oh no, we might want to take off. Like right now. We're gonna fly down the beach some more. Okay, where is he? Oh, he's down. Okay. Well, I'm gonna get this guy tamed up in three, two, one, and and tamed. I realize I said and twice, but that is okay. Um, we got her, so I will meet you guys back at base in a second. Okay, guys, we're back at base, and a couple things to show you. First of all, I got pooping and pooped saddles. Put them in here. Second of all, Harambe, right here. We got Harambe. We also have Cluck in the corner over there. Um, plus, we have Rudolph, Spike, our new Stego. Beep, I named our Pyrosaur, gave him a saddle. Roly Poly now has a saddle, and so does our new Easter Mike, which, by the way, let's give him some color. Oh, he got a nice red and white. I'm digging it. And up here, we, of course, have Fragrance and Yoshi, plus Iris. We also have Wave, Typhoon, and Tank. Tank, I will get a saddle soon. I just couldn't afford it. Now, finally, they end the episode off. Why don't we make some Easter cosmetics we haven't made any yet in today's easter so why not first of all let's learn the two new emotes those are on my list i guess now i also want um let's get a easter chick hat for doug and maybe let's get a bunny ear skin for me or for harambe Let's get this bunny costume skin. And it looks like we can afford one more thing. So why don't we try out this Easter egghead skin? Yeah, let's do it. Wait for all of this to finish. Oh, we can afford another one of these. Let's get a dino bunny ear skin. Why not? And I will just hit transfer all. Put back the stuff we need and let's showcase these things off. Okay. First off, we have the new emotes. Let's learn them. There we go. Bunny hop and tail wiggle. Now let's go into orbit camera. Emote. Oh, sorry. Wrong emote. You're going to want to go to Excellent Adventure. Bunny hop dance. Just looks like this. Okay. Okay. Okay, that's pretty nice. And Excellent Adventure has the wiggle tail emo. You're just wiggling your tail if you have the tail skin. Next, let's try out the hats. Chick hat looks like this. Oh, that's really cool. I've been wearing that for a while. Um, this is for the dino one. We have the human bunny ear skin. You need to get a haircut, but that also is looking pretty fresh. We have the egghead skin, if I can put that on. Oh, 
Let's zoom in on that. That's perfect. It's a little cupcake up there. Um, and we also have this bunny costume. Oh, wow. That's cool. Oh, <laughs> this is amazing. We're going to be wearing this for the next couple episodes, so get used to it. <laughs> this is what we're going to look like. Oh, that's silly. We can go ahead and put our chieftain hat on. I don't even think it'll show. Yeah. Oh, let's give Monkey Doug a hat, shall we? First of all, we need some fiber to become a hat. Okay, let's go over here. I also repaired my armor, by the way, when I was crafting all the saddles. But I am going to have to go on a metal run soon, because we are going club. I think I want, because we already have a skin, let's give Doug the chick hat. Come here, Doug. Let's see how that looks. Oh. Uh, if I can get a good angle, oh, that looks cute. And Doug's hair adds like a little mustache to the beak if you can see that. Okay, that's pretty cool. Now, I think I want to give Harambe a hat too. So, I think we can give him one. And we should also give Cluck a hat. Them three have been with me for a while. Let's give that to you. And Harambe can have this one. So, Harambe, here you go. Oh, look at Harambe the bunny. And Cluck, you can have a hat, right? You can't? Oh, that sucks. Sorry, Cluck. You're the OG man, you know it. So, I guess this egg hat has got to go to something. Maybe we'll obtain something in the future that could use this. But for now, let's just go put it into storage. And finally, before we leave, actually, I just realized we should give somebody... The bunny or skin? Who should it be? I think it should go to somebody that's been with us a while and has been a key player in our journey. That being Yoshi. Yoshi, you deserve this, buddy. Let's go. There you go. Look at Yoshi with his little bunny ears, if you can see that. And he keeps looking whichever way I'm not looking. But you can see it. So, let's end the episode off over here. And you guys, this was a fun episode to make. If you enjoyed, press the like and the subscribe button. They all help me. I appreciate it. And I will catch you in the next episode.